Hello, welcome back to my channel. Today, we're diving into the world of meme coins with a quick tutorial on how to buy GOAT, the AI meme agent token on Radium using your Phantom wallet. Don't worry if you're new to this, I'm going to break it down so it's super easy to follow. If we're meeting for the first time, I'm Blooming Morin, your trusted money coach, and I teach you how to invest in crypto and stock profitably. Simply put, I teach you how to make your money work for you. Now, for those of you that want personalized guidance, I'm offering a free 30 minute one on one coaching session. The link is in the description area below. So, now let's make this super easy and get you set up. Don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more helpful tutorials like this. So, let's get started. Note nothing in this video is financial or investment advice. This is only for educational and entertainment purposes only. Step one you need to install the Phantom Wallet. So, first off, you need a wallet to hold your crypto. If you don't have one, head over to phantom.app to download the Phantom Wallet extension for your browser or for the mobile app. It's free, it's secure, and it works seamlessly with Solana, which is the blockchain good is on. Right here, we're going to click on download. So depending on the type of browser you have, I'm going to be using the Google Chrome. So I'm going to click on Chrome. And right here, I'm going to click on add to Chrome. So go ahead and do that because we're going to be adding the Phantom Wallet app on our Google browser. Now I'm going to click on add extension. And this is downloading. Now it's been added to my Google Chrome. Now it brings you to this dashboard. So this is where if you don't have a phantom wallet, you're going to create a new wallet. But if you already have a wallet, this is where you're going to click on. I already have a wallet and walk through that process. So I'm going to be creating a new wallet. So click on create new wallet. So you have the option to continue with email or to create a seed phrase. Personally, I just prefer using the seed phrase. I prefer to create a seed phrase wallet. So I'm going to click on the second option. Now I'm going to create a password. So make sure that you create a password that is difficult. It's long, it's complex, and you're going to record that safely. Remember, never store your crypto password or seed phrase on any device that is connected to the internet. Okay, so I'm going to create a password for this Then click on agree to terms, click on continue. So now this is your secret recovery phrase. So you need to store this safely. Okay. And you're going to write it in order. So go ahead and write it down. So for you to see that you're going to click on the I button just at the center for you to be able to see the recovery phrase. So click on that to review the seed phrases. Remember that this phrase is the only way to recover your wallet. So don't share this with anybody. Once you've written all of this down, then you're going to click on I saved my secret recovery phrase and click on continue. Then you're all done. Okay. So click on get started. So now that we've downloaded the phantom wallet, we're going to click here. And right here, you can see that my balance here is zero for Solana. So step two, you need to fund your phantom wallet with Solana. So once you set up your phantom wallet, you need some Solana in your wallet to buy goods. So you need to buy Solana from any major crypto exchange like Binance, Coinbase, Bybit, Index, Coin, or any crypto exchange of your choice. After buying, you're going to transfer the Solana to your phantom wallet address. Remember, so is needed to pay for transaction fees on the Solana network. So for today's tutorial, I'm going to be transferring some Solana from Index, which is a Canadian crypto exchange, to my phantom wallet. I've already deposited some cash into my index wallet, so I'm going to be using that to buy some Solana and then move it to my phantom wallet. If you're in Canada, index is one of the top crypto exchanges to use. If you don't have an index account, I'm going to leave the link in the description area below for you to open an account. This is the crypto exchange I'm going to be using, so I'm going to log in. Right here, you can see that I have about $250 Canadian, so I'm going to be using that to buy some Solana. So right here, I'm going to click on Sol. And I just want to use everything, all the cash in my account. So I'm going to click on max and I'm going to click on buy. Click on confirm, agree. So now I'm going to be moving the Solana that I just bought into my Phantom Wallet. So I'm going to click on my Phantom Wallet extension right here. Now I want to receive some Solana, right? So I can either click here and click on receive and I click on copy. Click on close or I can just click on receive and click on Solana because again, I'm going to be sending Solana from index to my phantom wallet. So I'm going to click on copy is the same address and I'm going to go back to index. 
then click on wallet. Now I'm going to click on Solana, click on send, click on Solana. And I'm going to paste the wallet address that I just copied from Phantom, from my Phantom wallet. And I want to send everything. So I'm going to click on max, then check this box, then click on send. Next, enter the 2FA, then next, confirm the withdrawal via email. Then I'm going to wait a few minutes for the transaction to be processed. I just received the Solana that I just bought from Index. So now that we have some Solana in our Phantom wallet, step three, we're going to go to Radium. This is where we're going to swap Solana for gold, okay? So we're going to go to radium.io. I'm going to leave the link in the description area below. So right here, we need to connect our wallet. Okay, so I'm going to connect my wallet. So click on connect wallet. And now we're going to be using the Phantom wallet because that is the wallet I'm using. Click on Phantom. And right here, I'm going to click on Connect. And now it's been connected already. Okay. Once you've connected Radium to your Phantom wallet, now we're going to swap Solana for good. I'm going to click on Max. That is going to show my maximum Solana in my wallet. I'm going to click on this drop down here. And this is where I can search for the coin, which is good. But for me to get the accurate coin, I usually prefer to go on either CoinMicroCap or CoinGecko to get the accurate address just to make sure that I'm buying the right token. So I'm going to click on this because this is the token that we're buying. So I'm going to click on this address here, the contract address here, then come back to Radium. Then I'm going to paste the wallet address here. Then right here, I can see that this is the token that I want to buy. Then I'm going to click on this. So today I'm going to be using some of this to buy gold. So I'm just going to be using 0.1 Solana and that is going to give me this amount of gold and I'm just going to click on swap. And here I'm just going to click on confirm. And that's it. We've already swapped um, Solana for gold and and right here, you can see in my wallet that I now have some gold in my Phantom wallet. So th that's it. If you found this video helpful, make sure you smash the like button and also subscribe to my channel for more crypto tutorials. And don't forget to drop me a question or comment in the comment area below. And for personalized one-on-one -on -one session, go ahead and book a free 30 minutes one-on-one -on -one session with me. You're also going to see the link in the description area below. Until then, I'm Blooming the Morning, your trusted money coach.